Hello guys, welcome back to another episode of Monday FX. So in today's video, we are going to talk about FX console, which is very useful plugin for the After Effects. So you can download the FX console plugin from a video copilot website. So uh, here are some details of this. Uh, here are some details of this FX console plugin. So you can download for uh, Mac or you can download also for Windows. It's very easy to use in the After Effects. So in today's video, I'm going to show you that how you can use this FX console plugin inside the After Effects. So you can see that I have imported a raw footage into my timeline. So how we can use the FX console plugin here? So like I want to apply the wiggle effect onto my video. The basic concept to apply any wiggle effect simply right click on it and then uh, go to keyframe assets assistant and keyframe or layer style or choose the wiggle and there are lots of uh, confusing stuff with the help of with the help of this FX console plugin you have to simply press the control and space bar and here we have simply select your clip and press control or command plus space bar and here we have our search option FX console so here we can apply any effect uh, we want to apply on our clip or any uh, video so if I want to apply the wiggle effect simply search for wiggle click on wiggle position and here we have if you go to effect controls panel you can see that fs console applied all the required effect onto your clip like wiggle position and the transform so you have to simply change the wiggle speed like wiggle speed to 30 and wiggle amount to pixels like i think this is much better so you can play your video and here we have that's it here we have applied all the wiggle effect so you can see that here are the black portion so simply go to uh, transform section and then you can scale up your footage like here and here we have so you can see that we have easily applied the wiggle effect without any uh, confusing part so if i want to apply the another effect which is so if i want to apply the motion tile effect simply press ctrl or space bar and here we have fx console panel you don't have to navigate to effect and presets panel because after after going to effects and preset panel you have to search for any effect and after that you can apply but fx console is providing you most of the effect which is very useful to you and it apply the all and it will apply all the required effect onto your clip without any long process so if i want to apply the motion tile simply search for motion tile and here we have motion tile effect and that's it you can increase the output like 150 or like you can and here we have applied the motion tile effect 150 then 150 here we have our motion tile effect we have easily applied onto our clip so by using the fx console panel you can apply any effect onto your clip without going to effects and presets panel press control and here you can take your screenshot shift plus f5 so you can uh, so you can make some changes to your fx console panel like uh, you can choose the dark or light uh, theme you can change the shortcut key for control plus space or shift plus space or whatever you want to apply the custom keyboard shortcut to your fx console panel simply click on ok and here we have simply search any effect like uh, um, mirror effect mirror and here we have our mirror effect simply go to effects and presets panel apply for mirror and set it to 90 day and here we have mirror effect it's very easy to apply any effect uh, with the help of fx console panel so you can check out the all the details on the video copilot uh, website and i will leave link in the description down below so you can check out all the details about this fx console panel and x is fx preset quickly create fx shortcut create fx uh, overrides export snapshot with png automatic snapshot tool and gallery and much more so you can check out the all the details custom keyboard shortcut import and export uh, settings file tab to preset in search result over a dozen bug fixes in the upcoming tutorials we will talk about in depth of this fx console pl plugins that how you can use uh, wherever you want and uh, and how to use, apply any specific effect to your clip so that is for today guys this was the short video that how you can use the fx console plugin inside the adobe after effects so i hope you like this video if yes please give it thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe our youtube channel please share with your friends so goodbye for today catch you in the next one bye bye peace and see you later